and welcome to Dabbling in Journals. And oh my goodness, I have happy mail to unbox. I have a parcel here from one of my subscribers in Germany and a parcel here from one of my subscribers in the US. And I am so excited. I think I'm going to start with this one because it came first. I've been desperate to open it, but I needed to find time to do a video. Aha! I've saved, I'll save that little sticker which says with love for my journal. Let's pop it there and let's see what is inside. Oh my goodness! Oh, these are so exciting. And this envelope looks like it's made out of beautiful handmade paper that's got like flowers and leaves in it. Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? Take off. I wonder if I can take off the washi without damaging the envelope. Yes, more or less. Oh wow! And inside, oh, hang on. This I think is private, so I'm not going to show you what's inside because it's got a letter and some photographs, and I don't think. This lady would want me to share those. So I'm going to leave that to one side and look at them later. And look at this. Beautiful, beautiful. Live and love to the fullest. You're so lovely <laughs> with love. And a beautiful lace bow. And I shall definitely be using the lace in my journals because I love using lace in my journals. And that is really gorgeous. And I want to just gently open that so that I can save all these. I think it must be a washi tape. I've not seen that one before. It's really lovely. So I shall save all those little pieces. And this is this paper is really nice. It's tissue paper, but it's kind of like it's got this like crinkle in it. So, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, what have I got here? Oh, wow, 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 wow. <laughs> I've got it upside down, but oh, wow. I am so, so fortunate. I had no, I'm sorry, I just banged my tripod. Let me just check, I'm still in frame. I had no idea when I started my YouTube channel that I would meet so many lovely, kind, thoughtful, generous people to become friends with for happy mail. Oh my goodness. Well, I'm going to start at the bottom because what we have here looks to me like a traveller's notebook. Oh my goodness. Have you made this? I think you've made this and it is absolutely gorgeous. I have never seen a traveller's notebook made with paper before. That is so, so wonderful. So it's obviously been made of quite a stiff card covered with patterned paper and then she's punched holes and put little brass bits round for your centre elastic and for the inside strings. Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? Oh, wow. I am so want to have a go at making one of these. <laughs> oh, my goodness. What a wonderful idea. I'm definitely going to have a go at making one of these. And when I do, I will video it. In fact, I've got a video of making some inserts that I haven't shown you. I don't think I've uploaded it. So I need to do that too. That is so lovely. Thank you so much. So I'm going to refer to you as Kiwi because I don't think you would want me to give your name, but I know that's your YouTube name. So thank you so much, Kiwi, for sending me such a beautiful, beautiful thing. And I can't believe each time I open a happy mail, it's something different. And then inside we have a folder. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. Look at this. I really need to spend some time making some lovely things. So she's made a folder and it's like 
three sections and obviously this can go inside my traveler's notebook and it's all full of things so we've got tickets that's the paper it's lovely paper isn't it we've got tickets in a little pocket oh wow look at the butterflies <laughs> I know where I want to put that. I was looking for butterflies for my focus of the week this week. So I might try and remember to use that in that spread. Because it was a butterfly card that I picked. Oh, that's got a little... I hope you can't hear that alarm. My son's alarm is going off and he doesn't wake up. I can hear it. <laughs> it's just going on and on and on. Oh dear. Oh, look at all these lovely, lovely things. Oh, and I can't believe it. I'm just, wow. Wow, wow, wow. And I'm thinking, I don't know where they come from. They're in English. And you're in Germany, aren't you? And I've got washi tape. Oh, coffee. Coffee, that's perfect for my theme of January. It's going to be coffee. And I've got coffee washi tape and some pointy hands that remind me of Tim Holtz he always does pointy hands on a lovely little what is this that you all make your washi things out of it must be acetate I think it might be called acetate I'm gonna have to look for some of that oh so lovely thank you so much and then we fold it open and she's made a pocket on the side oh there's a little penguin I think her YouTube is kiwi penguin <laughs> so she's put a little penguin clip let's see what's in here oh my goodness so you must be a paper crafter because these are all really lovely little things that you've made oh wow look at these stickers oh croissants i love croissants and coffee and donuts and coffee <gasps> chocolate oh my goodness more coffee. Oh, I like that with the old-fashioned English. I don't know if it's just English. The old-fashioned glass milk bottle. We have milk delivered in these glass milk bottles. But unfortunately, since we've had our puppy, our dog started barking. She's guarding her. And she started barking. So she barks at the milk delivery person in the middle of the night. Because <laughs> it comes like at three in the morning. Oh, love, love, love. All these stickers are just absolutely gorgeous and I love the colours and I love the coffee themes and the breakfast themes and they are so beautiful. What have we got here? Playing cards. Wow, look at her. She looks Victorian. Playing cards. Oh, I've never thought of putting a playing card in a journal but what a lovely thing. Oh, and this is something that looks like you've cut out with a dye machine. That's really pretty. Oh, and what's here? Oh, washi tape, really skinny. Orange. It's orange, which is my favourite colour. Thank you so, so much. How can I get this all back? I want it all back so that I can do a picture. And where was the clip? The clip went like that. And it was somehow clipped onto there, but I don't know if I can do that. <laughs> I'm a bit ham-fisted. Look, I'm shaking with excitement. It's excitement today, not stress. <laughs> oh, look. And then the middle part is a belly, I think it's called a belly band, when you put a little band down the middle to hold things in. Oh, look at that. <laughs> it's like Mary Poppins, only a man. <laughs> He's flying with an umbrella. Oh, and an orange doily. I don't have any doilies other than ones I've been gifted by Happy Mail friends. So that's another thing to put on my list. Some beautiful butterflies. Are these stickers or is it paper? It's always hard to tell. I think it might be. Oh, no, it is stickers. What is stickers? Oh, lovely. I was looking for butterfly stickers the other day for my spread and I couldn't find any. 
Oh, wow. Am I showing you or am I too busy looking at it myself? <laughs> oh, and they all go in the belly band. And another little washi card with some really lovely vintagey washi tapes on, which I'll try and zoom in. And then in this part, I've got another really lovely envelope, all distressed around the edges. Oh my goodness, look at what's in here. You can see straight away I'm going to love these. Oh, home sweet home. More labels. Oh, look, a traveller's notebook one. Aren't these gorgeous, people? You'll be seeing all of these in my spreads. But you're all sending me so many things. I don't... Oh, my goodness, look at these. I wonder if you've cut these out. They're so intricate. If you've cut that with a dye machine... Wow. Oh, can you hear my dog? She's going to bark. Someone's going past the window. No, she's growling. She's guarding her puppy. <laughs> she doesn't really need guarding because she's safe in the house. Oh, wow. Oh, I really, really, really love these. This is just the most wonderful Happy Mail. You all send me much better Happy Mail than I make. I have to up my game. Oh, I don't know if I saw those. They're papers. Beautiful vintage papers. Oh. Oh, look, it's got a little bird on it. I love this colour. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. Thank you so, so, so much. And a little side. So she's done a side pocket there that goes all the way up, a belly band, and then a little corner pocket. And there's this beautiful Happy Mail clip. Don't have one of those either. It amazes me how many different things I receive. And that, obviously... Oh, there's more in the back! <laughs> oh, no, I already saw those. <laughs> I was like, oh, no, have I missed something? I, this can go inside this beautiful handmade traveller's notebook. Oh, I shall treasure this always. I will really treasure it. Oh, look at that. Wow, I'm so, I'm I, I I'm beside myself. I have a little little tiny thing here. Oh, with more penguins, some kiwi penguin. Thank you so much. What have we got in here? What's it gonna be? Ooh! Oh my goodness! These are the teeniest tiniest stamps I have ever seen. Look. They look like little pawns from a chess set. Can you see them? And this one, this one has definitely got coffee beans. And this one looks like some people dancing. I will stamp those for you. Shall I stamp those for you now so you can see them? Have I got any ink? Of course I've got ink. Who doesn't always have ink? So we've got coffee beans. Oh, green ink. That's a bit weird. It doesn't matter. Oh, oh, they're so lovely. Look at them. I shall get so much use out of that. And let's have a look at this one. And they're so small, they can go in your like bullet journal planner as well as other things. <laughs> can you see those? Let me try and get a nice clear image. And then I can zoom in. Are they karate? <laughs> they look like they're doing karate. Oh my goodness, I could use that in my planner to indicate karate because they look like they're kicking each other. <laughs> they're like little stick men. Oh, I really, really love these. Let me just clean it off. It's a, it's a water soluble ink, so I'll be able to wash them off. Oh, wow, thank you so much. I can see myself using those every week. As long as I don't lose them because look how tiny they are. <laughs> going to find somewhere safe to keep them and then you've also sent me oh wow book pages and they must be in German I have some Polish ones and now I have some German ones I don't know if it's German because I can't speak German oh wow oh, look at that picture beautiful cave and all 
this feels like handmade paper. It's been distressed. Oh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh, look. Ducks. And more bit pages. That looks like it might be an index or a dictionary. And so is that. Oh, look, there's a little... What, what kind of animal is that? Is it a weasel? I don't know. Or a stoat? Or a beaver? Might be a beaver. I don't know. Oh, gosh. Such a lovely, lovely happy mail. Thank you so much. I'm wondering whether to separate. I've taken so long opening it because there's so many things. Oh, wow. Look at this. Whistler. This is from an art book. Some beautiful illustrations. Oh, more beautiful handmade paper. Thank you so, so much, Kiwi Penguin. That is the most beautiful, thoughtful, beautifully made. <laughs> I'm blown away. I am blown away by this wonderful happy mail. Thank you so, 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 so much. Oh, wow. And this, this is just amazing. I love it. I will be putting more Happy Mail bits and pieces in here. I might make some more folders for it and use it for holding bits. Oh, that's going to take pride of place in my craft room, art room, journaling room, whatever I want to call this room. Thank you so, so, so much. And I have another parcel to open. I don't know. I'll have to have a look and see how long that video was. I might divide this into two. So here <laughs> I have another happy mail. How spoiled am I? Oh my goodness. And this is from Mal in the US. And let me see if I can remember. Are you Oregon? Might be. I'm gonna have to check. Oh it might say on her. Yes she is Oregon. Oregon. Oh wow, what have we got in here? Oh my goodness. And I have a letter. Oh, I have another letter to read. So I've got two letters to read, which I will do off camera. And what has she, oh my goodness, she sent me another load of stuff. Mel! Oh, oh my gosh, look at this. A traveller's company Japan envelope. Now, if you're not a journaler and you're not into traveller's company and you're not crazy like me, you'll have no idea why I'm so excited. Oh, wow. See, I just couldn't get this in the UK. There will be nowhere that I could get this. And I've never even seen it before. I've not even seen it on a video. And I love it. And I will treasure it. And I probably won't want to use it because it's just... Oh. oh, I so much love it. Thank you so much. And you seem to be able, in America, you seem to be able to get more traveller's notebook things than I can. And she sent me lots and lots of bits and pieces. Oh, my goodness. A turquoise. Traveller's passport. Ooh. I can't get it off. Don't want to break it. Do I have to break it? Surely I can just, nope, I can't, it's stuck firm. Oh, that was easy. It's just turquoise, oh no it is, it's turquoise paper inside. Oh wow, wouldn't that be lovely for journaling a trip to the seaside? Because it's such a beautiful seaside-y colour. I have never seen one of these. A turquoise one and it's Travellers Company or Travellers Factory, Travellers Notebook and Company. I don't know what this company is actually called. Travellers Factory or Travellers Company. Oh, oh I, I will save that for a trip to the, oh my goodness, what's this? I'm, trying, I'm saving that for a trip to the seaside. I'm going to have to write a list so I don't forget what I have. Oh my goodness. Washable paper. 
Okay, this is a B size and rare it is, and it's made from washable paper. <laughs> Why would you want to wash your notebook? But then if you're out in the rain, you can write in this. Or if you drop it in the sea. <laughs> washable paper. Do you know what? I might have to remove one sheet and try washing it. <laughs> How much fun will that be? You'd have to use permanent ink, wouldn't you? Because that otherwise it would wash off. Unless you use washable ink and then you wash your notebook. And then you can use it again. <laughs> or the ink would wash off. I don't know. Oh, I can't wait to experiment with this paper. Washable paper. I've never seen a top loading washing machine like that. <laughs> and I have another short trip one. Oh. I love these really thin ones because they don't take up hardly any space. And again, I can't... Oh, it's craft paper. Oh, that's going in my memory keeping journal. It's craft paper. Oh, do you know what? I'll love to draw on this. lovely thank you so so much Mel I don't know why you spoil me so much but I really appreciate it I really really do thank you what oh, California one travelers company USA so they must have you must have a travelers company shop in the in in the US I'm taking it because they don't do a travelers company UK they should shouldn't they <laughs> But, oh, dot grid. This is my first ever in my life dot grid notebook. I have never had a dot grid notebook. Oh, wow. I know they're really, really popular. I'm really going to enjoy using this, but it's so special. But you have to use special things, don't you? Because there's no point in having them and just hoarding them. It's not like I'm ever likely to go to the US. Oh... I did go once, like when I was really young, about 16, but it was, um, you know, Florida holiday to Disney, to Disneyland. And it was in difficult circumstances for me that I don't really like to remember, sadly. Okay, and, oh, black paper. Mel, you are a superstar. Thank you so much. The trouble is though, guys, you know what I like, but I don't know what you like send you things back so I hope you've told me things in your letters about yourselves that will help me know what you like <laughs> oh black one. Oh wow okay ideas please people what can I use a black traveler's notebook for well I can use it for journaling can't I if I use a white pen or a gold pen or a silver pen Oh, what an exciting collection of notebooks. Thank you so, 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 so much, Mel. Thank you, Kiwi. Don't let me forget one. You have absolutely made my day, guys. I hope I was in frame because I was so excited. <laughs> I forgot to even put my washi tape down. Somebody said to me, put washi tape so you know when you're going out of frame, which works really well if you remember to do it. And so, yes, guys, that was a wonderful Happy Mail from some of my lovely, lovely subscribers. And I'm looking forward now, once I switch off the camera, to reading your letters. And I will be sending something back to you <laughs> at some point, which I might video, but I wouldn't be able to show it until after I'd sent it, would I? So... Thank you so much, everybody, for watching and sharing my joy. And thank you again so much to both Mel and Kiwi for sending me such lovely things. I'm so lucky. I really appreciate it. And I love you all. Bye.